Okay, everything is dry. Now we just gotta put the finishing touch. And these are going in the restroom. So we're adding a industrial style towel rack, towel rack that we made. Yes. <laughs> Close. <laughs> So we have half inch pipe that's 18 inches long. We have a 90 degree elbow. And we have one of these things. I forgot the name of it. Do you know the name of this? It's a, I think it's a four flange. <laughs> that thing. <laughs> <laughs> it gives it that cool industrial look. So you just kind of put everything together. See how it's not perfectly black? We want to try to get it all the same color. So now spray paint. It's the fun part. We already have all of the lumber cut. So everything is good and ready to go for sizing purposes. Now we put it together. We're going to use some wood glue, sandpaper, a couple of drills. One is to pre-drill a hole. The other one is to put in the screws. So now you have part of it. The other part is going to be apt to add a front layer, and that's just to add to some dimension to the shelf. And in case you want to put any picture frames or anything on it, it'll hold it up. So we have put the shelves together. We have sanded, made them smooth. Now it's time to stain them. This is going to add that nice color to them and really give them that farmhouse and industrial look later on. I like this color in particular is because it does great with bringing out the texture and the pattern of the wood, the natural, and it gives it that really popular look. And what we're going to do, hold please, yes, is add these to the bottom. So shelf towels, they'll look good. Mark the studs. You also want a level so that you don't hang it all weird and crazy. We are finally done with the shelves and the towel racks in the bathroom. Now it's just time to decorate. Let's see if it works. There we go. <laughs> Stud finder's pretty accurate. Oh, oh. it did me. <laughs>